All right, welcome back. Now we got the truck. Uh, no, this is a separate video. All right, welcome to Ujulu Channel today. We got the truck all uh, cleaned up. We're getting ready, the truck ready oh, for yeah, winters. We're gonna try out Auto Fanatics Ultimate Secret Weapon Single Step. This is a, this product is a professional grade and multi uses right here. You can use this on a lot. That's what's nice about this product. And this product, we're gonna use it for to take a step of not clay barn. You can use this and as a clay bar. We're gonna be using the G9 on it, and that's gonna skip that step of clay barn. That's gonna be save a lot some time. And, and then plus two, this is supposed to take out some swirl marks and gives it a light polish also. And this thing has many uses for it. And so basically we're gonna, cause I wanna preserve the clear as much as possible on this 2004 F-150, it's 15 years old. I don't want to polish it every year. You know, if we polish this every year, then you figure 15 times or more, there will hardly be any clear left. Like there's some spots on the Corvette that's really light with clear coat and that's an 87. You know, cause clear coat does break down. So basically too, you can apply this by hand also. You can, you can apply it by hand if you want to just do a section or you can do a whole vehicle by hand. I've done it before. And it, you can take out swirl marks by hand with this or your DA. And this is great for if you want to just do your rockers. Like say you have you have a coating on here already, or a wax, or a sealant, or a coating, and you got some water spots or bird drops, and this will take it out without stripping that coating. And plus, this has canuba wax in it. So once we're done with this, I'm gonna have to rewash it with this soap, and then I'm gonna use a, a wax and grease remover to make sure it's gone, because this does have a canuba wax on it and you can use it on top of your wax and sealant so it will give you some protection when you use it and that's what's awesome too because especially like say you got a little spot you want to hit your scuff use this it cleans it up i'll when i have when i have uh situations like that i'll make a video using this product on you know 10 different things and you can use it on chrome also but today we're going to use it for a light polish get rid of some of the swirls and for the clay bar and it's not really that bad. I can feel a little bit, but we're gonna do the bag trick right here that we learned and just rub it. That's, you can feel it on the hood a little bit. This truck, we just been mainly using the, the waxes on it, the spray waxes. Yeah, you can feel it. Fender's not too bad. The hoods always get trashed, the hood and lower panel. So we're gonna use this and this should get rid of the tar for us, get rid of the whatever infections we had in the paint, the contaminants and we're set. we're set that's gonna skip a step and that's gonna save us some time all right we're gonna get set up and get going all right we're gonna get going we're gonna spread it out this stuff's pretty thin there's really not too much smell to it I'm not gonna hammer it there's a little right here red's nice look at that don't even have to use a lot of product we'll go about five We'll see. to it it's gonna be hard to see the difference in this gray paint but even on the bottle it says great for uh gray metallics and white it feels good oh yeah i feel a difference let me go get my bag real quick and then let's try it out all right we're gonna try it out oh yeah that is nice that's pretty smooth oh yeah you guys can hear what the a difference, difference actually in the bag I feel a couple spots, but not bad. Just a couple I can go back over. Yeah, it's not bad. Yeah, it did make a difference, that's for sure. Oh. Okay, now I'm, what I'm using too, I'm using the hex packs from Chemical Guys, the white. It's basically a light polish. Um, I think if I go, I'm going to change the pad and go with a more aggressive pad. 
and I think I'm gonna get a better results on it. I wanna try the lighter pad on it just in case. But yeah, it's it made a difference with just with the light cab. What a difference just from here. Wow, that's smooth, man. That is really smooth. Man, we're gonna lose our light. All right. I'm gonna have to get close. Man, what a difference. Get right on it. Go over here. You guys, man, I wish you guys could feel the difference. Holy cow. Yep, this will take place of uh, not clay bar. And you're doing like two things, three things at once, basically. Get rid of your clay. You don't have the clay bars. It's taking your contaminants off. It's getting rid of some swirl marks and some light scratches. Right there, you're getting a polishing and you're getting a canuba wax that's in this product on there. So, yeah, this even though I'm going to have to wash the car to strip that canuba wax out and go into that uh, different product, it still saves some steps. It really does. And this is perfect for if you got already have a protectant on your car and you need something like this just to do a touch up on a spot and you, you're not going to strip your, uh, your wax or coating. It's just going to take off what's on top of that coating. That's what, that's my opinion anyway. That's what I'm getting out of it. What a difference. Wow. I'm going to go with the orange pad now and see if I'm going to get a better cut. I'm trying out the orange pad. It's got a, that's more of a medium cut. Messing around with this product to see if we get a little bit better cut. Coming off pretty easy, huh? Oh yeah, it's easy to wipe. Get right there, that's fine. Yeah. I'm not doing no tape stuff on there. You kind of see it. I figure I did here, to here. Gray's hard to see. But man, I can tell even the difference of having working it. This works pretty good. Where's my bag at? I wanna hold the camera real quick. Oh, right, we use that orange pad. I gotta try to get this done. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. The orange pad's the way to go. Yup. Yup. The orange pad from Kemmel Guys, medium cut is the way to go with this product. To get more of a cut on the uh smoothness. Yeah. A little bit. I mean still the the white pad looks good. Feels good too, but I think a little bit more cut with the with the orange. You guys gotta play with it. If you use these products, just mess around and see what works for you. Everyone's paint's gonna be different. You're gonna have different uh, contaminants on your paint, stuff like that, you might, you know, and that's what you have to go by. But this is what I'm showing you my results for what we have with this truck. All right, we're gonna continue to go and then when, when we're done, we'll show the complete results. All right, we're still going. We got pretty much half the hood done. I got the my light out. Let's, what a difference. I am geeked up about this stuff is sweet. I mean, look at that, check that out. You got anything to add with it? Uh, just so you guys know, when putting it on, there's like no dust or nothing flies around when putting it on, which is really helpful. Especially when you like, you know, say you clean the windows, you have to use this product that doesn't go all over, which helps it out. Yeah, we're not getting no dusting. It's hard to see, but man, I can see a difference in the shine from here, that corner, to there. Hopefully you guys can see it because man, what a difference moving you guys around. Look at that. I see a difference even through the camera. I see it. This side on the driver's side looks like glass. This side, it still kind of looks, it's shiny, but it's not, not like the driver's side. Let me know in your comments. Man, this stuff is just, you got to use it to believe me. This stuff is, is sick. That's how good it is. Wow. I should have bought that stuff a while ago. Now this stuff is formulated. He, from, uh, if you, I'll have his link below. He talks about how this was a formulation back in the nineties late 80s 90s and he got with the uh, industrial chemist to come up with this with this uh back with this uh product again 
because um, it was tweaked out and it basically lost its luster and he wanted to bring this uh, this product back. And another thing too, this is not a sponsored video. I ordered this, I ordered two of these from um, Amazon. So I'll let you know that I paid for these products. I'm not sitting there saying, you know, doing it, thinking I'm getting free stuff, but nope, I bought the stuff. Yeah, you know, I bought I bought a few things from them on uh, Amazon. I just want to show that that works. All right, we're going to keep going. Most likely we'll have to finish up tomorrow because we're going to be losing our light and we'll finish this up tomorrow. No big deal. We'll just rewash it and do it again. <laughs> Let's check the paint. Man, that looks good. Look at that. Look at you can you see look at look at the clouds. Look at the clouds through that hood from the secret weapon. Look at that. That's crazy. <laughs> wow. All right, get the chrome. Spreads out nice. Check that out. Took the water spots right off. We got some more right here. Let's get them. Oh yeah, gone. Here's our water test. And that's just with that secret weapon that has Kanuba in it. Look at that. It sheets right off. Oh. Missed. Even falls right off the middle, but that's the angle anyway. Bam! That's bam, bam, boom! All right, we got the water test done. Grab the bottle. We'll check out the paint. Look at that. This man, this stuff is awesome. I mean, it's a single step too. This has canuba wax in it. So we're gonna be going to uh, getting it ready for winter. So we're gonna have to strip it. I'm gonna strip it with uh, wax and grease remover. And then I'm gonna rewash it with this soap and stuff like that. Make sure it's really clean. Get rid of that canuba uh, that's in there because it's fresh. And then, uh, but check out the results. Man, I wish you were here to see how smooth it is. The paint so smooth. It didn't even look smooth. I mean, look at it. I mean, man, I'm gonna walk around in and talk to so you guys. Check it out. Man, give a nice shine to it. And this, man, it's just, unbelievable and it's the first time this truck's ever been uh polished and this truck is 15 years old pretty dang good because we want to preserve the clear coat as much as possible for the winter months in michigan look at that yeah with the canoe wind well action here you can actually if you guys are mobile detailers you can um offer this in your services you know me if i did this exterior would be between 100 and 150 because it's gonna take step um you're not gonna clay bar you're gonna use this instead of clay barn and it, it works it really works it saves that steps it saves you uh saves you from having detail spray or clay bar and uh that saves a lot of time also it saves you know us between 30 minutes to an hour it depends that's what i would charge between 100 and 150 and do a little extra too because this has canuba and explain to them that this won't last that long and that would might throw a little spray on there you know can you imagine you can throw whatever a different uh, wax on there to protect it for your customers or for yourself if you want to do your vehicle real quick and plus too you can use this on top of um your existing sealants waxes or coatings if you have uh water spots this thing has many uses that's what's nice about this as whatever the days go on and this and that if i ever when i have to grab this i will make a video on it because you can this has a man this is like an all-in-one i mean i mean it's perfect i mean look at that i'm very happy with this i should have bought this a long time ago you know and this video is not sponsored again, and I have his uh, link below. We pay for it. It's $29 right here, and you can pick this up at Amazon now, too. 
he said his products on Amazon now. You know, I don't say though, hey, you should buy this, but man, if you guys want your vehicle clean and not have a bunch of products, this is one to have. I mean, I would not have all the detailing products if I didn't enjoy uh, testing them out, but I enjoy doing it. But if it just have a few products, this would be definitely the one to have in the garage. This is just, man, it's awesome. Even for the weekend warriors and professionals, man, you gotta try this stuff out. I know I'm, you know, and it, I don't get paid by nothing. I had to pay for it, so it's it's awesome. What do you think of it? All right, the kid didn't want to talk, but it came out nice. Look at that. So that's about it for this video right here. Check this out, man. This is a must-have. Dang, I'm geeked how it came out. Wow. You guys tell me in the comments below. All right, guys. Thanks for watching this video about secret weapon. Something. Um, I don't know. I recommend it. I really do. Alright guys, you guys have a good one. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment. Alright, later.